people, my people, what you see before you are the primary ingredients minus the ice for a dark and stormy. I was so damn impressed with the uh, dark and stormy from Jimmy Rum. I thought I would go out and make my own. Now, a note for the innocent. The jug is full of my homemade ginger syrup. I find that most of the gingers that are in alcoholic products that I try are just simply too sweet. I'm a boy well experienced in Southeast Asia. I like my ginger to have a burn. Ginger is not ginger unless it's got the heat and that's what I'm bringing you today. The only thing missing from this equation is this with an ice cube in it. So Jimmy Rum, Navy Strength Rum, Soda Water, Homemade ginger syrup. Now people, people, my people, as I've said in the write-up, my cocktails are not pretty, but I assure you this one will go far, down faster than a submarine with an open hatch. So what I'm going to do is, give you the sound of happiness, I'm going to tip two shots of this Navy Strength rum into a glass. Count them. One, that's two, remember the review of this baby, she was big on the butterscotch for some reason, thank God for James, go and see that uh, interview I did with the man himself. So I'm going to pour a healthy measure. Of this wonderful ginger syrup it's so natural you can actually see the ginger itself going into it I'll pour that in i'm going to give it a preliminary stir to make sure that everything is adding the way it should be and i'll add my soda water which is a generic brand at my local woolworths um, in the freezer so it's been a stinky hot day in melbourne Everything is as ice cold as I can make it because it's, well, it's what you do. So I'm gonna pour this in as it melts around it. I know, cinematography at its absolute finest, people. Yep, there we have it. Perfect. I'm gonna give it another stir. This is above proof happiness. It's got ginger in it, real ginger, and I'm going to give it a shot because, well, I'm going to test drive. I don't want to get poisoning people, my people. Okay. The one thing I'm absolutely going to do is tip a fair bit more of this ginger syrup in because I like my spices. I'm the sort of guy who adds chili to his breakfast so his kids don't eat it. It's ice cold. As I film in this in um, late February, it has been a stinking hot day. And this is removing my ability to uh, care much about anything. Mmm. Oh, hell yeah. This shits over the commercially bought varieties by such a large margin it's just like today it was a long hot summer's day and this shits all over the commercially bought versions of ginger syrup by such a large amount we barely mention them in the same breath so thank you people my people this is a dark and stormy using the navy strength rum from jimmy rum who else would i would go buy from in victoria a bog ordinary soda water from my um, local Woolworths and a ginger syrup where if you uh, actually comment or send me um, a message I'll actually supply you the recipe for. So I don't know whether it's a dark and stormy or giving a rat's ass remover. Either way you have to go and make your own. I think because you're big people you can call it whatever the hell you want. You can call it Bob. Thank you, people, my people. Subscribe, like, share, and stay tuned for more delicious cocktails. They may not be pretty, but trust me, they'll do the job.